how to win the Super Bowl. Um, first day we entertained this idea, we talked about the uh, importance of fight. You got to agonize, you got to fight, you got to be physical. Uh, yesterday we looked at fast, you got to have speed. Uh, fast afoot, but also fast thinking, quick decisions. Uh, today, the key word is focus. The key word is focus. Keep your eye on the prize. In this passage of the Apostle Paul, um, he says that he's already being poured out like a drink offering. The time of his departure is at hand. Fought the good fight, uh, finished the race, kept the faith. Therefore, is laid up for him the crown of righteousness, whom the righteous judge himself will give him upon that day not only to him, but to all who long for and love his appearing. Uh, the crown of righteousness. Um, the Bible talks about crowns in two different kinds of ways. Uh, the laurel wreath, the stephana, that's this word, uh, was given to athletes as they would compete and win. You remember when the Olympics were in Athens, not only did you get a, a medal, but you got a laurel wreath if you were a winner. Uh, Paul reminds us that these laurel wreaths, these stephana, we get our name Stephen or Stephanie, crown, uh, laurel wreath, uh, these kind of crowns uh, perish, but there is an eternal crown. Uh, here, Paul calls it the crown of righteousness. Sometimes it's called the crown of life, or the crown of glory, um, whom Jesus, the righteous judge, is going to give him. Man, oh man. Um, if you want to win the Super Bowl, you need to keep your eye on the prize. Uh, you need to focus on the goal, which is the trophy. Uh, it is the crown. It is worth it. But even, we need to be reminded even that winning a Super Bowl is great, but Paul describes it in 1 Corinthians as a corruptible or a perishable crown. But the crown that believers get uh, is the crown that never fades away, that never perishes. And someday we will cast at the feet of Jesus and cry out, you alone are worthy to receive glory, honor, and power. For you have created all things, and for your pleasure we are, and we were created. Holy, holy, holy. You gotta focus. Everything laid aside, no excuses. We know there's injuries in football games and penalties and, and turnovers and all different kinds of things. You gotta stay focused upon the prize. And for the Apostle Paul, it was the crown of righteousness. Hope you've had a wonderful day. God bless you. Have a good evening.